Good morning, friends. This is Pastor Joe Palikathail. Today is Monday, January 13, 2014. I bring you greetings. Greetings of the amazing love of the Lord Jesus Christ. Sisters and brothers, let us open up our heart to Jesus and welcome his greetings into our heart, his greetings of amazing love, and give that greetings to everyone throughout this day, both in our thoughts, words, and deeds. <clears throat> Let me invite you to continue our meditation on the Gospel according to Matthew chapter 12. Today, let us focus in on verse 38. There we read, some of the Pharisees and the teachers of the law telling Jesus, Teacher, we want to see a miraculous sign from you. A miraculous sign from you. They were not satisfied with all the miracles Jesus had already done. They wanted to perform a miracle just for themselves so that they may believe. Sisters and brothers, we are not too far from them. We also desire miraculous signs from God, from Jesus Christ. <laughs> when I was struggling with the idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis, I and all sorts of friends and relatives prayed for a miracle for me. Somehow I got the idea that Jesus is going to heal me by Christmas, Christmas of 2011. We prayed for that. In fact, some of my friends fasted and prayed for that. There are several churches prayed for me to have that Christmas miracle, a gift of complete healing for me, but it did not happen. When it did not happen, I was disappointed. Then I thought maybe God's plan was for me to have a perfect healing, that is, by my death, I'll be completely healed, will go into heaven. So I began to prepare for that. But the Lord's plan was for me to have an Easter miracle the following year, 2012. 2012, Good Friday, I was taken into surgery for a double lung transplant surgery. And Easter Sunday morning, I woke up. Sisters and brothers, God has miracles for us. But we have to wait upon him for his timing, for his particular way of dealing with us. Each one of us is unique to Jesus Christ. He died for each one of us. He has given us the promise and the guarantee that he is going to be with us always. He will never give up on us, that he will only give us the best. Sisters and brothers, throughout this day, let us ask Jesus for the help that we need to renew our commitment to him, our faith in him, and stay with him, committed to him, wait upon him, so that we may see miracles that he does all around us and within us. Would you join me in this prayer? Let us pray. Eternal Father, we thank you for all the miracles you have, you have done, worked all around us. The miracle of heaven and earth. The miracle of all sorts of things right here upon earth. Thank you, Father, for all sorts of miracles. The miracle of creating us and sustaining us. The miracle of giving up your Son on the cross that we may have eternal life. Precious Lord Jesus Christ, we glorify you, we praise you, we thank you 
for giving up your life on the cross that we may have the miracle of eternal life. Your real presence within us. Oh, precious Lord, enable us to experience your presence, your amazing love right within us, all around us at all the times. Oh, Holy Spirit, continue to ignite the fire of faith in us, the fire of love in us, the fire of hope in us, that we may continue to stay in Christ, live in Christ, and let, let Christ live in us. Oh, Jesus, transform us by the, fire, by the fire of your presence. We ask this blessing, Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen.